time for Potentially Yours. Every Tuesday, we try to give pets to the Dane County Humane Society a new place to call home. This is Mr. McGiblets. <laughs> right. Alive here. and well. He yeah. is happy and in one piece. Right mm -hmm. here. He nice. is a little guinea pig. And Mr. McGiblets, how can you not just adopt him from that name right there? He, <laughs> yeah. like, it, he's a character. And he's only about a year old. He was just surrendered. Um, the woman that had to surrender him was wasn't able to keep him in the apartment she had to move to. Mm -hmm. And so okay. she said he's great. She loves him. Um, he's very outgoing. She would let him run mm. around the room. <laughs> I mean, he's just, guinea pigs are a cute little critter mm -hmm. and something different. Mr. Carrot. McGiblet's Have eating his breakfast. And he's hungry. Yum, 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 how, yum. how long do guinea pigs live? They live about anywhere from like five to seven, eight years old. So, you know, it's a little bit more of a time commitment, but not mm -hmm. as long as maybe a, you know, well, kind of like a dog or cat, too, but they're definitely not as much um, re responsibility, I guess I should say. I mean, they still need to have their cage clean. They need time and interaction, mm -hmm. but it's not like you need to take them out on walks. Um, but they're fun little critters that are very smart. They actually can learn to be litter box trained, um, but they like to be social, um, and they... They oh kind of have gosh. their own little personalities, which are fun to, what a cutie. to see. And they're, you know, kind of a nice maybe pet if you're having a younger kid wanting them to learn some responsibility. Um, it's not as mm -hmm. much of a commitment as maybe a dog or a cat, but, um, but definitely just a fun little critter. And I wish, I, don't, I know he won't do it on command, but mm -hmm. they make the cutest little squeaking noises when they mm -hmm. get excited. And it's like, wait, 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 wait. See, there you go. Wait. He won't do it, so but it's so cute. They pretty much dine on... Uh, Veggies and stuff. Um, like it's that? good to have. Make sure that they have Anybody a diet that has veggies, but they also Many have pellets. Um, pellets. Yep, okay. they're special pellets for mm -hmm. them. Um, and then they also have, or they Anybody? eat hay too. So um, got a lot of stuff. Can yeah. Squeak? Um, quickly, yeah. Gail, how about last week's pet? <laughs> oh, the handsome Duke, the big boy that Duke. really mm -hmm. likes John. And Duke got adopted that afternoon from someone oh, that really? watched oh, him. Good. And um, he hadn't gotten any attention, and these. The family came in and said we just fell in love with him from the morning oh, show. Oh, so Duke great. is happy in his home, and that's good. You're so eyeing me. Little McGiblets needs <laughs> some <laughs> love. Gail, he's running. <laughs> <laughs> McGiblets is taking off. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Gail. Thank you. Thank you guys. Thanks, <laughs> all right, you can check out all the uh, animals up for adoption <laughs> at the Dane County Humane Society. You can go to GiveShelter.org or set up an appointment by calling the number. Oh, oh hang on, buddy. On can screen. I just grab them? Yeah. You okay. I just grab them. Don't squeeze too okay. hard. Okay. He's running. He's running. <laughs> Corral you. We're all good. Okay. okay.